welcome to another Mickey Art Acrylic Pour Playtime. <laughs> now, um, I have been playing off camera and I just wanted to show you a couple of things that I played with last night um, after you were turned off. And that was just a little bit of cardboard that I dipped into the Uh, how well can you see that? Here we go. That's better. How cool is that? I think it's cool. So I'm probably going to make something jewelry-ish out of that. And then I quite like this one. I like the way the... Um, ooh, I don't know if we can get it to focus quite that much. Oh, yes, you can. Oh. I quite like the way this has done some micro cells. Um, I'm not excited about this burnt sienna that I have. It's I don't know whether it was old stock and that's why it was on sale or whether it's just crap. Um, this one's quite cool, but if you can see there in the corner, bottom right corner, this corner, whatever way that um, that shows up for you. Um, that brown is quite lumpy and I have tried and tried and tried to get rid of it all so who knows what magic can be created here's a much browner one uh, these colors aren't really coming out very well Ooh, that, that's a good shot there we go and here's the piece de resistance. This was my corner catcher. And how pretty is that? See that gold glittering. And then the pinks and greens swirling. It's so pretty. How does it get any better than that? So, anyway, the, um, Oil is still drying. I'll give you another quick glimpse of that. Um, there we go. Now my husband's decided that this is the Slither Io painting because this bit here looks like a <laughs> a snake from Slither Io. Uh, if you haven't played that game, probably not a good idea to start. It's rather addictive. So today I'm again playing with colours, playing with combinations and um, so as I said I've mixed up some of this brown and I, I'm getting that this is probably just an old old batch. Um, it's pretty pretty gluggy when I pour it out it's, when I, when I, it's kind of congealed really um, so I've been test patching down here a little bit they seem to have got it reasonably smooth but there's still some definitely some stringiness going in on, the, on in there and uh, if any of you know how to get rid of the stringiness, I would be super, super grateful. Um, you just see a bit of texture when it's sitting on the... Oh, we're going to give it a go anyway, because it's the only brown I have, burnt sienna I have. Um, this is my homemade turquoise. Um, I really like the turquoises that... Um, and Marie makes and so this is a mix of my Marie's dark blue and my Reeves green now these are the same apparently but they sure as hang don't mix the same this one comes out nice and smooth and 
And then of course I added some white to get it to be this light color. Now, I don't remember what I've mixed any of them with. Some of them have got PVA glue. Some of them have got a tiller liquefying medium. Some of them have got Floetrol. They've all got water. I can tell you that much. They've all got some water in there. Um, and then I found in my kid's play cupboard some of this Tempura poster paint. Now, it's not high quality. It's kid's poster paint. And non-toxic. So I'll give that a go. See if it works. And that way, if it does... The Kiwi teachers could perhaps play with some of this with the kids. Um, so I've also just been watching another <laughs> really fun girl um, on YouTube. And uh, I really... Don't recall her name. Anyway, she doesn't use silicon, she just uses water with a little bit of dish detergent in it. I thought, well, I'm using the super cheap paint. Let's give the bubbles in the, in the water a go as well. So that seems to have reasonably good consistency. This is the closest thing to liquid paint I actually have. But it's been in my cupboard for a few years, so how liquid it actually is, who knows. So, let's get going. I need a clean tin. As usual, I'm using my tuna tins. Yay! Let's just check you've got a decent focus going on there. Um, now... I did some playing with the turquoise and white. I've got white in here too. Um, yes, last and the brown last night, and uh, they, um, yeah, the brown is the one that breaks apart and lets the other ones through. So. What I thought I might do, and I know everyone starts with white because that's the one that normally falls through, but who knows? Let's give this slightly, I'm going to add some more water in there. I wonder if I put some dishwater in there that night. Because I know this has got Floetrol and PVA in it, so I'm wondering if... I don't know. Who knows really what's going on? I've added another light. Can you see any difference? Change my lights around. Anyway, so I'm going to put some of that in and then I'm going to put some white in and then I'm going to put some blue in. Uh, then I might put some more brown in and put the red in. Woo! That dropped straight through. How does it get any better? Um, where are we up to? Put more uh, white. And some more blue. Wow, we've got a lot of paint in there. All right. How does it get any better than that? Do we put the gold in now? Let's just put a little bit of, little bit of gold 
into there. Got a little bit left to do some pretty bits if we choose. Do I need to stir it? Yes, no, no. Okay, cool. Once again, I'm using the tile because you know the tile is pretty cool and that it's washable. <laughs> okay, so this is the tile I did my tests on last night, so boom. Dun, dun. Oh, stop sliding. Oh, that looks pretty cool. Are we ready? Do, 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 do. Wowza. That's not very central. Oh, look at those cells starting to form. Now, I know that I did put some silicon in the white. I don't really want big lumps of pink. It isn't really a pink kind of painting. I do want a corner catcher though. Now, if you want to find out who Emery got this from, find the first video that she used corner catcher on and she wrote his name. And whoever that was, I think his name was Alan. Oh, I can see some gold. I like gold, LLC. What I am seeing is some breakup of the paint. that gold. Don't mind if I lose some of that red. And one last corner. Ooh, we're getting some pink on the corner catcher. That does look a bit more better than that. We are completely covered now. Can you see all through here? We've got quite a bit of feathering going on. So, what's creating that? I don't know. But let's get the torch on it. Look at this. Something's working, and because I have no idea what's in anything, I have no idea what's working. How does it get any better than that?
we've got quite a plain band through here. And I've got quite a bit. more paint Bit of a ribbon of gold in there. That is getting better. Mm -hmm. There's definitely some snow action coming in that ribbon. Oh, I'm so glad I chose that. quite like that that one's quite cool now we've got one of those little holes <laughs> right here I don't know if you can see it it's um it's where a oh oh my goodness I'm gonna show you this check this out Can you see how pretty that is? Oh, it's dripping all over my... Wow, yummy, 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 yummy. Do, 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 do. Now, I'm... You know me, I like to play. I like play, I like play. And I'm... Just... If I put just a drop in there, I adore this gold, it is so shimmery. I want a drop in there. I'm not a huge brown fan, which is really quite funny, seeing as I've made brown so prominent in this. my toothpick. Call me a toothpick. Wow. Sounds. <laughs> Look at the cells popping through. That's so cool.
because they turned the music up. Anything more? Do I need to do anything more, guys? What do you know? Yes, no. No glider. Okay, cool. Let's go with the no. Follow the light. If it's lighter, it's right for you. Now, let me get you down and show you what. Oh, it's not been in focus. That's right about that. I'm not getting. This camera doesn't seem to like to focus of its own accord. Check that out. Alright, let's go on in. I don't think I can take my flash off, sorry. Look at the gold sparklies. It's like a river of gold. How's it getting any better? And I really like down in here. Can you get that? Check out some of the patterns in there. <laughs> There's my little swirly bits that I just drew. Look at the little gold birds. I'm hoping they stay up on top. They have stayed up on top on the other ones. Look at that. It's so pretty. I really like this. So glad it the ribbons. Alright guys. So there you go. There's my play. Let's go back down and have a look at that. Pretty as corner catcher. OMG. That whole thing's beautiful. <laughs> How does it get any better than that? Even the bits that fall off the side are beautiful. Check out those under there. All right, beautiful people, how much fun can we all have? What can you add to your life that gives you ease and joy and glory? And are you willing to have ease and joy and glory? So till next time, thank you and bye-bye.